Ayo, and welcome back everyone to Hasa Cards for this week's video of Football Friday, super late edition. Was waiting all day for these boxes to come in from UPS. I don't know what happened, but finally, I'm going to tear into a new release with these two 2021 Onyx Vintage Football Hobby Boxes with two guaranteed on-card autographs per box. Looking for on-card autographs of top 2021 rookies of Zach Wilson, Trey Lance, Kyle Pitts, Justin Fields, and Mac Jones. Trevor Lawrence is in this product, but only as a redemption, so looking for him as well, but probably not going to hit him. Uh, this also features, for some reason, Justin Herbert and Eli Manning. No idea why. Very odd release. Uh, this is their first football release ever, so clearly still figuring things out. Uh, but for the prices of everything in 2021, I think this is worth a shot. But first, a quick rundown of where I got this box and what to expect inside. Let's go to the back. Here it is. All right, as you can see right on the back of the box, you get one pack per box, four cards per pack with two on-card autographs. I actually pre-ordered these from BlowoutCards.com for $75 a piece. And it's actually the same cost as this tra Topps Trevor Lawrence box right here. Uh, I find that very fascinating because this sold out in like one hour. Uh, and you get no autographs in here and it's also unlicensed just like this. This is very much available and has two on-card autographs. So very interesting. Sometimes the hobby just doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Nevertheless, hoping to hit a top 10 pick with one of these four autographs. And maybe one of the Cleveland Browns draft picks would also be very nice. Only one way to find out. Let's do this. Here we go. Box number one as I'm opening this, a quick plug very soon that I am actually doing a live stream tomorrow morning if you're watching this Friday night, or this morning if you're watching this on Saturday, 10 a.m. Pacific, May 8th, with JPN Sports Cards, Rikon Sports Cards, and Spurs Cards 21. We'll be discussing the state of the retail hobby, specifically uh, Target policy with their one purse. So hope to see you all there. We usually end up with a giveaway as well. Let's see how this first pack goes though. Here we go. Oh man, starting us off. First time seeing any Onyx. Uh, they actually have baseball as well. I think backdating to 2013 or so. Here we go. Looking at football first time. Chuba Hubbard starting us off. I will go to the back first here. Thomas Graham next up. Cornerback. You can see up top there is the rookie. Let's take a look at these backs there. Very nice. Kind of reminds me of like a Topps Heritage, if you will. Maybe like Fleer Tradition back in the day. Not bad. So here come the hits. So the first and final cards are the base. First hit is going to be, you have no idea. That looks like a QB, right? Tylen Wallace, wide receiver, blue on card autograph. And let's see who the next one is. Oh, man. That also looks like a quarterback. Sam Ellinger. Very nice. Wow. Quarterback hit. There we go. And that is a green autograph. Very interesting. Oh, so that's right. So on the back, there you go. They're, these are not individually numbered, but green is numbered to 50. And then here is blue right here. Blue is the most common, numbered to 400. There you go. So getting red or black are going to be the most difficult hits. Not bad at all, though. I'll sure I'll post down below where these guys are at. I know Ellinger is with uh, the Colts, I believe, which is a great spot for him, I think. Box number two. Here we go. I definitely like that first one. Hitting a quarterback. Nice. Going to have to look into Wallace, though. Name sounds familiar, but I'm drawing a blank right now. Here we go. Pack number two. Very interesting box, <laughs> by the way. Uh, I'm also giving uh, Onyx a shot here for baseball coming up. I think that comes out in a week or two. Yeah, going to give him a shot. It's very cheap, especially for baseball. All right, here we go. Back to the real deal. Dylan Moses starting us off from Alabama. That is his rookie. So I'm not getting any of the veterans that have been in here so far. Next up. Amon Ross St. Brown. Wow, I've not heard of that name. Uh, USC, I'm guessing there. Yep, base. There we go. Another base of Dylan Moses, linebacker. And let's see who the hits are going to be this time. Oregon? Is that Oregon? Uh, it's not Sam Hurt. I was going to say. <laughs> nope, that is not. Uh, but this is a Browns hit. Very nice. Demetric Felton. Very cool. That's a running back for the Browns. <laughs> so I'm going to take it. Very cool. I think he was our fifth or sixth round pick. Not bad at all. So I actually get to keep one of these. Very cool. And the final card is going to be, no idea, Nick Bolton. <laughs> no idea. Both are going to be blue autos. So out of 400, out of Missouri, Nick Bolton. Unfamiliar with him. Again, I'm sure I'll put them down below. 
keeping Demetric Felton, though. That's pretty cool. Not sure where exactly he's going to be playing with the Browns next year, but yeah, overall, I think the Sam Ellinger is going to be the best hit. The green autograph. Very cool to get four autographs. All right, and before I close things up, it is time to reveal the winner of last week's giveaway, this hanger box of 2020 Donruss. Hopefully this one has a Joey B or Herbert in there for you. Thank you again to everyone who entered. Your fate now lies in the hands of my daughter's iPad as always. <laughs> Here we go. We'll do it. Super late night wheel. Here we go. The winner of the Donruss hanger is going to be... Fester. UNC Fester, congrats, buddy. You are the winner of the 2020 Donruss hanger box. Reach out to me on IG. Shoot me your uh, address, and I will send this out to you as quickly as I can. Congrats, buddy. You get the Donruss hanger, and thank you all so much to everyone else who entered. Good luck on next week's giveaway. And that is going to wrap up this week's video of Football Friday with two hobby boxes of 2021 Onyx Vintage Football. Let me know what you thought of the polls, the autographs, and the design in the comment section below. Not bad at all. Like hitting all the autographs, and again, 150 bucks for four on-card autographs in 2021. Not too shabby. Let me know what you thought as well, and as always, some of these cards will be available in my eBay store, which is listed in the description box below. And as always, I'd also greatly appreciate it if you already haven't, if you hit that subscribe button. Alright everyone, continue staying safe and healthy out there. Take care. See you all next time. Yeah.